The House Ad Hoc Committee investigating the sales and disposal of public property has issued a final warning to the Nigerian Customs Service over constant failure to appear before it. The chairman of the Ad Hoc Committee, Honorable Julius Ihonbere, issued this threat on Wednesday at the ongoing investigation in Abuja that the committee will not hesitate to ensure the custom boss faces the full wrath of the law. Plus TV Emmanuel Ehegene filed in this report and presented from our studio. The chairman of the ad hoc committee, Honorable Julius Ihomberi, criticized the customs service for ignoring its summons after two invitations. He frowned at the attitude of the Comptroller General of Customs for allowing the committee to spend scarce taxpayers' money on newspaper publications. I think what the customs is assuming is that this ad hoc committee has a limitless life. Just like if you import a vehicle, there is a time within which you must clear it before it goes into demolition. And after some time, they will take necessary steps within and even auction your vehicle, no matter the type. So I think it is irresponsible of the Nigerian customs to once again take the invitation to this house lightly. They think this is a joke. I want to assure them I'm ready to go the entire length of the law with the Nigerian customs. They must appear before the House. However, the ad hoc committee later met with the Nigerian Ports Authority but asked the management to come back next week Monday with relevant documents after failure to impress with its presentation. Uh, we, have re we have received some payment and uh, uh, based on the remitter that was generated by Nigerian Post Authority. We have a receipt of payments. So technically with the receipt of payments, uh, it means payment has been made. And uh, uh, once the payment has been made, then the, 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 the winning or the winner of the bid uh, is able to carry out the asset with the, uh, with the supervision of the disposal committee indeed. Now you've told us the list of auctioneers that you appointed. There's nothing, I've gone through this document. I want to see where you, the valuers that valued what you have auctioned. You have an asset you want to dispose of. It is not our business, it is your decision. But we want to know, when was this purchased? For how much? And how are you, much are you selling it for? So we are going to give you time. Please look at what we asked for and some of the questions we have raised here and number the pages appropriately. That way we can flow with you. Documents requested include list of properties listed for auctioning, evaluation reports and name of registered valuers involved, including their reports, government's approval, including Office of the BPP, Federal Executive Council, as well as certification of no objection, amongst others. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.